Is it your misfortune and not my own? Take a tie, I owe, get along, you little dog. You know that the ferry will be your new home. And now for the thrilling adventure, Lightning Jim and the Mad Killer Dirk. A stagecoach rumbled along the stage trail as a masked rider suddenly came out from behind a protecting boulder. Oh, there! Oh, oh! Get him up, driver. Yeah, sure. Get on off of that coach. Sure. And don't try to reach for them six shooters, your talking partner. Well... You're wasting your time, mister. I ain't carrying no passengers and, and no cash. Well, ain't that too bad? <laughs> well, I'll be doggone. Howdy, Swim. I don't recognize you with that mask on, stranger. <laughs> don't remember me, huh? Well, take a look. Killer Dirk. <laughs> yeah, Killer Dirk. Surprised, ain't you? Uh, sure. I thought you was in jail, Dirk. <laughs> I was. Busted loose, huh? Yeah, two days ago. But you was lucky, Slim. Lucky? Yeah. When Lightning Jim and that sweet deputy trapped us in that gold mine, you was on the outside and got clear. Yep, yeah, I got away. Yeah, Marshal figured he'd broke up the Dirk gang. Well, the rest of the boys are still in jail, but Killer Dirk is loose. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, but what are you aiming to do? Get Lightning Jim. Get Lightning Jim? Yeah. And you're going to help me, Slim. Now, now, hold on, Dirk. I ain't taking a hand in that game. What's the matter? You gone soft? Yeah, maybe so. When Lightning Jim broke up the gang, I came north and got this job driving the stage. I've been going straight. Right. <laughs> uh, that's a good one. <laughs> ah, but listen, Dirk. Your grudge again, Lightning Jim, is your own affair. And you got to leave me out of it. Slim, you never give me orders before and you ain't starting now. You know why they call me Killer Dirk? Well, sure, then but... Then maybe this shooting iron will help you change your mind. Hey, wait, now. Don't, don't Are you shoot. playing my game or do I drill you? Well, sure, I, I'm with you, Dirk. <laughs> That's better. And remember, one wrong move and I'll drill you clean. Yeah, sure. Where are you taking the stage? In the next town is Mountain Valley. Then on up to Fort Anderson. Fort Anderson, huh? That's where Lightning Jim heads in, ain't it? Yeah, but... I'm telling you, when you start out to get Lightning Jim, you're you're fooling with dynamite. Dynamite, huh? <laughs> now, that's an idea. Well, I don't have to tell you he's the fastest drawn umbre on the plains. Yeah. Well, he ain't gonna get the chance to draw. <laughs> I'm gonna set a trap for him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kill a dirt <dunk> trap. <laughs> <laughs> The criminals and desperados of the Old West both feared and respected the reputation of United States Marshal Lightning Jim Whipple. But Killer Dirk was no ordinary outlaw. He was a savage, half-crazed, cold-blooded killer obsessed with a desire for revenge against Lightning Jim. We joined the Marshal and his deputy, Whitey Lawson, at their headquarters at Fort Anderson. What? You remember we sent a father, Edo Smith? Yeah. We all went to come to wish to us today. Oh, is that so? You ought to come in on a state coach and stay to bring in my puppy dog with them. Well, that's good news, buddy. Oh, see, I can hardly wait, by golly. I always wanted a good dog, and now I got one. Yeah. By him, and I'm going to teach him lots of tricks, too. Huh? Teach who tricks? The dog. What do you think I'm talking about? <laughs> I'm sorry, Whitey. I was just thinking about something else. If I snow, I'm more trouble. Yeah. The ranchers up around Willow Creek have been having trouble with rustlers. Well, that looks like some work for us. Yeah, I reckon so. 
Get the horses, Whitey. We're going up to see the sheriff at Bardsville. Yeah, but uh, what's about it? Then it's off coming today. Well, we'll follow the stage trail up past Willow Creek, and most likely we'll be running into it. Oh, him. yeah, see, that's good. I want to see that puppy dog, and the sooner the quicker. <laughs> Hold your tongue. When you talk to me in front of people, my name's Smith. Sam Smith. Get us? All right. Taking out passengers? Yeah, reckon so. Any cash? Nope. Not this trip. Going to Fort Anderson, huh? Yep. Hey, wait. It looks like one of my passengers coming now. Mm-hmm. Pardon me, gentlemen. Uh, which one of you is the stage driver? Yeah, right here, mister. What can I do for you? How soon is the stage going out? Yeah, about now. Where? Where are you going? I'm going to Fort Anderson. I'm in on the stage ahead of you, but she broke down. They told me I'd be riding with you. Yeah, sure. Say, uh, what's that box you're carrying, partner? Why, this is a camera, mister. A camera? Uh, what do you do with it? Take a picture. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I heard of them picture machines. Hey, how, how does it work? Well, I got her all loaded. And say, how does it... Is that thing shoot? Shoot? Oh, sure. It shoots pictures. <laughs> That's very funny, mister. Uh, yeah. I thought so, too. You see, all, all you do is just point it like Don't this. Don't point that thing at me. Well, it won't hurt you, mister. I just want to take the picture. Put that thing down or I'll blow your head off. Uh, don't shoot. I didn't mean no harm. Honest, I didn't. Listen, Greenhorn, don't you never point that contraption at me again, you understand? <laughs> sure. I get you, mister. Oh, there. Oh, boy. <laughs> Come on, Rita. Get out. All right. Come on, Pop. <laughs> Come back here. Yeah, get that dog out of here. Stop it. Come here. Get out of here. I'll... Hey, what's the idea of kicking that dog? Huh? He was aiming to bite me, wasn't he? Why, he's only a puppy. He wouldn't bite you. You have no right to kick him. Is that so? Well, any dog that barks at me is going to get kicked, and if that ain't enough, I'll drill him and make sure he down. Oh, no, you don't. You try to shoot that dog and see what happens to you. Why? Hey, hold on, folks. Ain't no use losing your tempers over a dog. Oh, stop it. Do you hear me? If you want that dog to live, you better be trying him up. Now, driver, come over to the Eaton house before you pull out. You know that man, driver? <laughs> Why, sure. He's all right. He got a trigger temper, and I reckon he don't take much to dogs. Don't worry about him. Well, he had no right to kick the dog just because he barked. That's what I say, ma'am. Why, he was going to shoot my head off just because I wanted to get his picture. Can you imagine that? My golly, you ought to be in jail. That's what. Where are you folks going? Fort Anderson. Why, say, that's where I'm going. Glad I'm going to have company. Sally Carr's my name, but the boys out here call me Chicago Charlie because that's where I live. Uh, glad you know you, Mr. Carr. Uh, this is my daughter, Rita. How are you, ma'am? Howdy. So you had a fight with that bully, too, eh? I uh, sure did. Thinks he's mighty handy with the shooting iron. Well, he ought to meet up with someone I know. A man who really knows how to handle a six shooter. Well, who's that? Lightning Jim Whipple, the United States Marshal. Do you know Lightning Jim? Do I know him? Say, him and me as old friends. Well, that's why I'm going down to Fort Anderson. To see him and his deputy, Whitey Al Larson. Is that so? Uh, did you hear that, Richard? I sure did. Mister, we know Lightning and Whitey, too. No. Yeah, it was Lightning Jim who saved my life. He caught a fellow who killed my brother and wounded me. Yeah, by golly, we do know him. Well, it sure is a small world. Imagine all of us meeting up like we did and finding we're all friends of Lightning and Jim. Yeah, and me and Pa are going down to Fort Anderson to see them, too. Well, it looks like we're going to have a big reunion. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh I almost <laughs> forgot. We're taking this dog to Whitey. Our sheep dog, Jenny, had a litter of pups, and I promised Whitey he could have this one. Well, say, he's going to be mighty tickled, because that's a fine puppy. <laughs> yeah, he, he wants to shake hands, by golly. Uh, pardon me, folks. I've I got a little business to do before we pull out. Uh, I'll be back in a little while. Yeah, that's all right, mister. i got to take uh, this uh, uh, down to the uh, livery stable. Anyhow, the team... <laughs> <laughs> hey, what you laughing at? I just had me an idea. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I told you I figured to set a trap for lightning, Jim. Yeah? 
Well, I kind of got a notion these friends of his and are going to help us. What? <laughs> You're taking that old man and his daughter in that green one on the stage, ain't you? Sure. The stage trail crosses Willow Creek, don't it? Yep, and our first stop is the stage station at uh, Elm Fork. And then we go over to Willow Creek and into Fort Anderson. And north of the creek is Boulder Canyon. Sure. And up in that canyon is the old Boulder Mine. Yep, uh, but it ain't been worked for years. So much the better. Won't likely be nobody around to bother us. Yeah, I don't follow you. Now, what you planning to do? I'll be waiting for you at the Willow Creek Bridge. I'm holding up the stage. Yeah. Yeah, the old man in that city just ought to be carrying cash. Nah, that ain't what I'm driving at. Well, if you ain't taking the cash, well, what are you holding up a stage for? I'm taking the gal, Savvy. Oh. And what are you going to do with her? Take her up to the Boulder Mine, and I'll be leaving tracks a blind man could follow. Oh, yeah? <laughs> you take the other two hombres into Fort Anderson and tell Lightning Jim you was held up and the girl was kidnapped, you understand? Yeah, sure. The marshal and his deputy will pick up the trail easy and walk right into the trap, see? Oh, yeah. They pick him off from ambush. Nah. Shooting's too good for them coyotes. Got a better idea. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> right now, I got to pick up some dynamite. Dynamite? Yeah. When you set a trap for rats, you use cheese. Well, I'm setting a trap for two skunk law badges, and I'm using dynamite. <laughs> <laughs> Will mad killer Dirk be able to carry out his plot to get Lightning Jim? The exciting climax of this thrilling story will come in part two, which follows immediately. Now for part two of the Lightning Jim adventure, Lightning Jim and the Mad Killer Dirk. The stagecoach that is taking Rita, Adolph, and Chicago Charlie to Fort Anderson pulls up at a stage station along the trail. Oh, whoa there! Oh. Yeah, yeah, this is the Elm Fork station, folks. As soon as we change teams, we'll be moving on to Fort Anderson. Good. Well, let us get out and stretch a bit. Uh, come on, Pop. <laughs> Guys, I'm stiff as a boy. Yeah, by golly, these stagecoaches got hot feet. <laughs> by golly, here come two riders. Yeah, and when you look, who it is? Oh, from the oh, road, boy. Where's Lightning Jim and Ryder? Howdy, folks. Hello there. Welcome, boys. Yeah, oh, it's yeah. good to see you again, yeah, by golly. Hold it, boys, hold it. I want to get your picture. Thunder Asian, Whitey. Will you look who's here? You be minute. Chicago, surely. Oh, well, can you picture that? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to steal my stuff, eh? Oh, surely. Hey, no, where did you and Rita pick up this great cab? At Mountain Valley. Mountain Valley. Ah, yeah, he did not have no brand on him, so we brought him along. <laughs> well, if you ask me, I think Charlie's camera's a pretty good brand. <laughs> That's right, ma'am. Sure. My camera is brand new. Oh. <laughs> yes, sir, when it comes to bomb Yorkshire, you take the price, surely. Oh, is that so? Now, just for that, I won't take your picture. Oh. But you, you bring him in. It's my pop picture, is it? <laughs> my <laughs> girlish look. Say, the last time I seen her, she was just a uh, tiny little thing. My goodness, she's getting big, though. Yeah, <laughs> she's, she's a smart dog, my Oh, you, you just wait till I teach her some tricks. Yeah, that gives me an idea, Whitey. You teach the dog to catch outlaws, and we won't have to work no more. <laughs> <laughs> well, say, that is the fun as you think, Lightning. Like, <laughs> this little Yiddish mom, uh, she helped us catch the fella that shot it off, didn't That's it? right, Whitey. Ah, Jenny is the smartest dog that ever lived, my darling. Oh, that's what you think, Adolf, but... 
I can get any daughter smarter. <laughs> hey, you're lightning, lightning. Get back on your horses, Oh, eh? oh here comes Charlie with his camera. Uh, oh, yes, sir. Oh. I want a picture of Lightning Jim and Thunder and Whitey and his new dog. Well, see, that ain't such a bad daddy. You like him? Sure. Uh, we'd like a picture like that, wouldn't we, Paul? No, sure. There you see. Go on, get on your horses, boy. Yo, uh, come on, Leslie. All right. Boy. Come here, Thunder. Come here, boy. Come on. That's the boy. Lightning. Thunder's the prettiest piece of horse flesh I ever saw. Oh, he sure is, ma'am. Look, Thunder. Say, Mr. Smith, boy, will you hand yeah. the puppy to Whitey? Yeah. Well, uh, you want me to hold the dog up here on the shed? Oh, that's right. Yeah. Uh, come here, Pope. <laughs> here. There. There you are, Whitey. <laughs> <laughs> you got to sit still. Huh, <laughs> <laughs> Sidney? Yeah. My baby. Oh, Whitey. 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 Oh,
the bottle that's up from the stagecoach. Please don't hurt her. She's just a puppy. Well, I don't like dogs, see? She starts barking at me like she's done before, I'll throw her. Oh, she won't bark at me. She better not if she knows what's good for her. Sit down on that rock. Well, if it's money you want, park and get it. It ain't money I'm after. I'm setting a little trap for your friend, the United States Marshal. You, you mean Lightning Jim? <laughs> yeah, Lightning Jim. <laughs> you see this package I got? <laughs> it's a little present for the Marshal. <laughs> <laughs> And that's the way it happened, Lightning. Gosh, I thought you'd never get here. Charlie, you say the bandit held up the stage at Willow Creek? Yeah, and he took Reed on his horse and went north. North to the creek at Fort Le Canyon. Yeah, and Adolph took one of the stage horses? Sure. He took the driver's guns and lit out after the bandit and Rita. Looks like this driver must go hoot with the outlaw. Yeah, you take him to the jail and then we're heading for Boulder Canyon. <laughs> Yeah, when I have to look at them tracks. Yeah, yeah, seems like that outlaw weren't too smart. Well, then he seek to follow his trail. Huh? Yeah, he could have gone over the rock, but he took the open ground and left fresh tracks all the way. You can see he done that on purpose. Looks like it, buddy. So then maybe this is a trap. Get down, buddy. No. See behind this log. That's what came from behind the tree over there. Put up your hands, whoever you are. I've got you covered. You've been in minutes. Just easy, though. Hey, now. Don't shoot. It's me and Whitey. Lightning, Jim. Thank God you come. Good thing you spoke up, Adolf. You were ready to shoot it off. So what was the close one? Yeah, it's so dark I couldn't see who it was. I lost the trail. Lightning, we've got to find Rita. Take it easy, Adolf. He'll catch up with that Jasper. Did Charlie tell you? Yeah, he told us everything. Uh, why did he take Rita? Well, that's what we got to find out. No, but it won't be so easy to follow the trail in the dark. Yeah, most likely he's taken us to a cabin or cave up here in the canyon. Why do you cross over and go up the far ridge? Adolf, you come with me. Yeah. Now listen, keep low, be careful. We we'll meet at the north end of the canyon by the waterfall. No, and I just hope I get the Jaeger before we meet again. I tell you that. Poor boy. Easy boy. Hands up. One moment, I'm choking. All right, mister. What are you doing up here, partner? I was just going up to board, Swede. <laughs> well, that's a good one, Swede. I know who you are, Whitey Larson. Where's your partner, Lightning Jim? Oh, he's still around, I guess. No, he's not stopped. Well, I want to see him bad. Gee, what to do that for? You two must have been together, so maybe them shots will bring him here. about the place where we heard them shots, Adolf. Yeah. By golly, it looks like a cave. No, Adolf, that's the entrance to an old mine. It's been deserted for years. But we forgot it was here. <laughs> Don't move, Adolf. Look, beside that rock. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get him? No, the rock saved him. You think he's alone? <laughs> Can't be sure yet. Uh, no use shooting it out, Lightning Jim. I got the girl. And just sweet peppery. <laughs> you hear that? He got mighty, too. Yeah. You better come out peaceable or I'll drill these two. Why, the dirty loot. Hold don't... on, Adolf. Sounds like a crazy man. Can't take any chances. All right, mister. Keep your hands in the air, Marshal. Sure. Come on, Adolf. When we get up to him, you call the reader. Maybe I can get a chance to draw on him. Yeah. Come on, come on. I ain't waiting all night. All right, mister. We're coming. Well, well, if it ain't the old man, too. <laughs> well, seems like everybody's here. <laughs> this is the end of your trail, Lightning Jim. Where's my daughter? <laughs> You'll see. Rita! Rita! 
Ah, you son of a... Get away from me. Get away from me, I... Oh! Oh! Hey, you like me. Oh. You got him like me? Yeah. Thanks to the dog. Clank. Clank. Is he dead? Yeah. Good Lord, Adolf. I know this, Jasper. It's Killer Dirk. Rita and Whitey must be inside. Come on, quick, now. Yeah. Here, here they are. Yeah. I'm glad you take Rita and I have the quiet here. Rita, are you all right? Uh, I'm all right. Uh, Peter, what's that pipe, my darling? Is he with you? Yeah. There you are. Did you get him? Yeah, I got him, Whitey. Uh, uh, yeah, and the puppy's your head, sir. My darling. That's right, Adolf. When he heard your voice, he came running out of here and bumped into Dirk. When Bert turned, I had a chance to draw and shoot. Well, you mean, I told you she was a smart dog. <laughs> Did you know this man before, Whitey? Yes, ma'am. Whitey and me trapped Dirk and his gang in a mine. It wouldn't come out, so we threatened to blow him out with dynamite. No. Uh, that explains why this man put dynamite in here. Dynamite? Yes. There's the fuse running outside. He was going to capture you and set that fire to the fuse. You're blowing us all off with this idea. I guess you will right, Well, you was right, right here. He was a madman. Yeah. <laughs> So you see, surely, there was my dog that saved the day. Holy smoke. That sure was a close one. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Well, folks, Chicago Charlie has got a real surprise oh, for you. Oh, yeah, that kind of a surprise. Yeah. Here, take a look at this picture. Well, you mean, this is the picture I like the name and me and the dog. The one Charlie took at the stage station. Oh, let me see. Yeah, let's have a look at it. Why no, you? me too. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, it's a hell Oh, it's wonderful. Yeah, that is the best picture that I've ever seen by oh, Charlie. Oh, it's certainly oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at the dog sitting up there on the saddle with me. We got a new one. Oh, wait a minute. I think she's the best thing in the picture. <laughs> And so ends another thrilling chapter in the lives of United States Marshal Lightning Jim Whipple and his deputy, Whitey Larson. Mm -hmm.